Hi, welcome to this video guide. Today I'm going to show you how to create a budget. By creating a budget, you can discover areas of opportunities where you can save money. You can also set goals or limits and have the ability to view where you stand within those goals at any time. And most importantly, you can prepare for future expenses. So open up Quicken and let's begin. The first thing you want to do is navigate to the planning tab. You should have the option to create a budget. So click on get started and let's begin. The first thing you want to do is name your budget. I'm just going to leave it as budget one, but you can enter anything you want. If you check under advanced budget settings, you have the option of creating your budget starting from January to December or choosing a different month to start your budget on. I'll leave it as a default, so I'll hit OK. And Quicken will start creating your budget. The budget is created with categories that are currently used in your account registers. One of the first things you want to do is determine what categories you want to budget. Click on Select Categories to Budget so that you can customize your budget. Once you have determined what categories you want to budget, click on OK to continue. You can also access this option through the Budget Actions menu, which brings us to our next step, selecting accounts to budget. You are able to include or exclude accounts from your budget, so customize it to whatever fits your needs and click OK to continue. Now that you've laid the groundwork for your budget, it's time to start thinking about your amounts. You will notice that Quicken has already created some default amounts based on your purchase history. If you don't agree with the amounts or want a much tighter budget, you have the option of customizing all the amounts to your preference and liking. You will see that every time you adjust a category amount, the whole budget amount changes with it. Make sure to adjust everything so it fits your needs. Let me show you in this quick example. The first category we have is auto and transport, and the budget is $185 a month. Say I want to reduce that amount by 100, so we'll just enter 85. You will see that the whole budget amount now is reduced by $100 for that adjustment I just made. One last thing, if you ever need to create a new budget or delete an existing one, or simply run a report, you'll find these options and many more by clicking on the budget actions button. So now you're ready to create your own budget and start saving. Thanks for watching.